there, everybody. You know, around the country right now, um, remote learning is in full swing, and uh, it's time for science class. That's right. Joining us uh, right now is our very good friend, Science Bob. He's going to teach us how to make ice cream. Hi, Bob. How are you? Hello, guys. Very nice to see you. You ready for science class? We are so ready. Look, Mark, Mark is not really ready for science class. He's ready for ice cream. All right, sure. So what's better than yeah. having a science class where I think we're going to combine home ec, uh, science, and even a little uh, PE in one lesson. Perfect. We like it. Teach us. All right, so here's what you're going to need. Uh, you're going to need some half and half or some uh, milk and cream. Uh, we got about eight ounces or 250 milliliters. Uh, we got about four teaspoons of good old sugar. Uh, we've got, uh, what else we got? Uh, some coloring of your choice. I've got some vanilla here. If you want to make chocolate ice cream, you could do a little, uh, you know, chocolate syrup. Uh, then you're going to need a big old bowl of some crushed ice. And okay. finally, uh, you're going to need uh, some salt, somewhere between a quarter cup and a half cup. All set? Got it. Yes. Yep. All right. We're ready. What's first? So let's take you through it. Step number one, you're going to take that uh, half and half, and you're going to pour it into a small Ziploc bag. You can take one that you've Got recycled it. if you want. That's going to go in there. Now, uh, to that, you're going to sprinkle in your sugar. And sugar. Uh, then a little bit of uh, flavoring in there, about maybe like a okay. quarter yep. spoon. That. There we go. Mm -hmm. All right, okay. that's a, oh my oh, gosh! Yeah. A quarter, that's a, that was a quarter teaspoon. That was <laughs> a whole table, a tablespoon. Okay, that's fine. It's gonna be very vanilla. -y. All right, give it a little mix. Make sure you got that zip good and tight. Give it a mix. <laughs> got it. Got it. All right, and then uh, get a bigger bag, like maybe a gallon if you have it, and okay. uh, throw that into the bigger bag. What did you do, Mark? He put, it in, the he put it in the bigger bag. All right, never mind. I'm gonna, That's I'm okay. Gonna, I'm going to this. I'm going to use a smaller bag. All right. Get the ice in it, right? You adapt. Wait. In science, you adapt. Yeah. All right. So get, get the bag with the stuff in it into another bag, and then pour the ice in. All right? Okay. Be tricky. All right. Yeah, something like that. Got it. No, I got to put right. that in there. Okay. Then you add the ice. Ah, uh, exactly. I did one last night, so it's fine. Okay, good. <laughs> okay, we're watching you, Science Bob. All right, there we go. To that, this is where the science comes in. You're going to sprinkle the salt the on salt. that. All right, now, a chemical reaction has already started. It's called an endothermic chemical reaction. So this is going to force the uh, ice to get colder. It's going to borrow heat from objects around it. So we're going to start mixing this around. And this is when sort of the PE part comes in. I recommend you dance, put some music on, uh, mix this around. So this is going to go on somewhere between five and seven minutes. All right? Mm -hmm. It's going to draw out the heat from that. Are freezing up. There you go, Kelly. That's it. All right. Now, through the miracle of television, uh, because you don't want to watch us shake for like seven minutes, uh, we I got this one all set. <laughs> so, this one has been, uh, I've shook this for about uh, five or six minutes. That's all it takes. The endothermic reaction has happened. Now, you might want to give this a little rinse before mm -hmm. you. Uh, before you finish, get all the salt off it. All right, but then open it up. Oh yeah, oh, this is looking good. So here we go. That is some ice cream of science, a few sprinkles. There we go. Oh, it's good. Oh, so good. good. Okay. All right, so I want you to know I've got all the instructions for this uh, at sciencebob.com. Lots of experience. We had lots of people make the lava lamp last time. Yep. They love the lava, lava lamp, and yep. this is even better because this is delicious. This is really good. Mm. Right, you can eat. Oh, okay. There you go. We put ours in a dish. Um, now, listen, you have, an, you have another experiment 
Um, can you tell us what that is? Because we're going to put it up online. We got another one uh, up online. It's a little bit messier, uh, but we'll have it uh, for you online for it. So you can check it out. It's a lot of fun, though. Definitely worth doing. Is it about making slime or something? It's uh, about making a non-Newtonian liquid. That's the I see, when he, sa he says things, and I just am immediately drawn in. Yeah. Science Bob, you are seriously the best. We love having you, and Thanks you give us, you educate us, and everything you do is fun. So thank you so much for making it um, fun and educational. And stay safe, okay? Uh, you do the same. So good to see you.